uh, this is the chapter which is many which is mentioned in many grades so what to do to simplify this concept exponents and powers now let us take a small example that is 2 raised to the power 3 so here we have to multiply the number 2 how many times three times because the exponent or we can say the power here is 3 so what you have to do 2 into 2 into 2 now many students gets confused when it comes to this kind of multiplication they what what they do 2 3 ja 6 that is wrong or 3 into 2 6 that is also wrong so what you have to do 2 into 2 into 2 means 2 into 2 is 4 then after multiplying these two numbers we get 4 then multiply this result with the next number that is 4 into 2 8 so the power 2 raised to the power 3 results in 8 take a take a, another example 3 raised to the power 2 so here the number 3 is having the exponent 2 So what we have to do? We have to multiply the number three. How many times? Two times. Not three into two or two into three. It is three into three. Three into three is nine. So yes, three raised to the power two is nine. Now it comes when the power is negative. Oh, what we have to do? Yes, five raised to the power minus one. So we all know if a number has power one, then the answer is the number itself. So if I say five raised to the power one means plus one only, then the answer is five only. But if five raised to the power minus one is uh, mentioned here, so what you have to do? You have to take the reciprocal of this number. Now again a new concept, reciprocal. So what we have to do in case of reciprocal? nothing but 1 in the numerator divided by this base number that is 5 so 1 upon 5 is the answer of this number let us take a simple example 3 only number 3 and i ask you that you have to take the reciprocal of 3 so what you have to do 1 upon 3 in the same way if i ask you 1 upon 4 You have to take the reciprocal of one upon four. Then what you will do? Four will come in the numerator and one will go to the denominator. That is only number four. So this was about the exponent, the basic concept of exponents. Now, if we move on further, the questions that we find in our books like six into six into six into six. So you have to. Uh, frame this number in the form of exponent so what you have to do how many times six has been written here it is 1 2 3 4 so write this number six as the base we call this as base number so six and how many times four times so six raised to the power 4 in the same way if i ask you Minus two into minus two into minus two. So we have to again write this number in the form of exponent. So what we will write? Minus two. How many times? One, two, three. So minus two raised to the power three is the answer. So this was about the uh, formation of exponent number and uh, the concept of exponent and power. In the next lecture, we will study about the laws of exponents. So, thanks, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video and the concept, please like, share, and subscribe our channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon. And one more thing, if you want to take the online coaching as well as offline coaching for basically the science and mathematics subjects. from standard class 6 to class 12 11th and 12th as optional and also the technical graduate students so you can contact to the whatsapp number that is mentioned in the description box thank you so much for watching